Are you new to vinyl? If so, these are three things that you really don't want to do, especially if you're around other people who collect vinyl or have vinyl who have been doing it a lot longer than you. We're going to start out with number one, a terminology thing. What's the plural of vinyl? Well, the plural of vinyl is not vinyls. It's vinyl. You have one vinyl, you have many vinyl. Don't ever let record store owners, people in record shops, and other longtime collectors catch you calling it vinyls. Number two, don't stack your records. One thing you'll never see in my collection is a big stack of records. If one does happen to show up, it's for the briefest of moments before they go back upright. Why? By stacking, you're putting a lot of weight on the record itself, which can damage it over time. The bigger the stack, the longer it sits, the more chance you're going to have of warping the records on the bottom. Don't stack them. Number three, vinyl is great. I absolutely love vinyl, but one big issue is that it's kind of fragile. Don't ever hold it by the grooves. One, you're going to get fingerprints on it. Two, you're going to get scratches on it. Three, you're going to get dust and grime and grit and grease in the grooves themselves. That's going to affect your playback, and that is not something you want to mess with. Right here, I have the second disc from Sunny Day Real Estate's 30th anniversary pressing of Diary. This is how you're going to want to hold it. I can hold it like this. This is fine. This is fine. It's in a sleeve. It's not going to get my fingerprints on it. But as I pull it out, see where my fingers are. They're on the label. See where my thumb is. It is on the edge. It's not curled around touching the grooves. It's on the edge. That is how you hold vinyl records. And when I flip it, I just have it nice and comfortable between... I'm not touching the grooves, once again. There it is. Your three things you'd want to avoid at all costs if you are new to vinyl. And if you're a longtime vinyl collector and you're doing these, well, shame on you. My channel is all about vinyl, from stories hidden in the grooves from within my collection to tips for vinyl collectors and much, much more. Next, here are some other tips if you're new to vinyl that you should probably know about. I'm Andy. This is the Fence Post Vinyl Channel. I'll catch you in the next video.